everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got Knobsite's new Halo 3 inch off road pods. Now, these things are pretty cool looking. We're going to go ahead and do a quick um, opening. We're going to look and see what we got in the package. We're going to get right to installation. This should be a pretty cut and dry, very simple plug and play installation. So, let's see what we got here. So, we're going to get the box, obviously very well um, designed it looks like uh, when you open this up here if you can see they actually give you a bunch of uh, stats here which is pretty cool you know um, it gives you the beam pattern and spreads kind of shows you how the mounting is going to work um, gives you all of your specs QR codes and stuff like that they were at the SEMA so that's pretty awesome so you got the the SEMA some stickers and some just uh, really cool things you can add to your truck, right? That's pretty neat. Uh, always like having, you know, some some stickers and whatnot to add to your truck. So what are we going to get here? All right. So in the package, you're going to be getting, it looks like, your lights, your wiring harness, and um, these are going to be your covers. If you're in a Virginia, if you're in a state like Virginia, it's good to have these covers um, because of how the DMV does their, you know, vehicle checks and whatnot. So let me just pop this stuff out here a second. So we've got our wiring harness. Um, we've got our mounting hardware. Got our brackets here. Easy day. And then it looks like we're going to have our really cool looking uh, lights here. So check those out. Those are nice looking. Easy plug and play uh, plugs. Gonna get your wiring harness. Now this is an easy wiring harness. This is plug and play. It actually comes with a redesigned switch, which is really nice. It's got rubber. It's got a little back here for mounting, and they even give you a little uh, plate here for mounting. Now you're gonna ask, what are these wires here? These are synchronization wires. Um, so obviously you connect these to your negative and positive terminals to give it power. However. If you want to sync these up with your actual running lights for your vehicle, this is how you do it. Knobsite does recommend you have this done by a professional. If you don't know what you're doing, don't cut into your wiring harness. And I am not a mechanic, so uh, please don't do anything that you know you wouldn't do yourself and take responsibility for yourself, of course. Um, so I'm going to I'm going to do a basic installation and uh, show you how to do it with these uh, just uh, positive and negative terminals. All right, y'all. So just to give you guys a rundown, I'm just going to show you real quick under the hood what I'm going to be doing. Yep. <laughs> These are nice to have by Redline Tuning if you don't already have them. So what we're going to do here, and it's pretty simple. I already, so I explained to you guys I have a switch panel here. So what we're going to do is I'm simply going to hook them up to the positive and the negative battery terminal. I'm going to run the wire probably inside my uh, window here so I can toggle it just so we can see how the lights function. And then later on, I'm going to splice the wire up into my panel here and we are going to get it all done. I'll show you how to do this. It's very simple. We're just going to pop this off, plug all these wires in. We're going to get everything situated.
Now what we need to do, this is going to go to the switch, and I'm simply, for demonstration purposes, going to run it through my window here. Um, and I'm just going to tuck this uh, in the corner, probably up here. And then I'm going to split these off like this. One is going to go to the other side, and one is going to go to this side, uh, so they can uh, plug in. So let me show you how I'm going to do that real quick. I'm gonna finish up getting these wired in and we're gonna op test them. All right guys, so I have uh, the lights all good to go in the switch here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just, this is daylight, right? You can't see it very well, but we're gonna show you. So uh, you're gonna go ahead and press for these to come on. Woo, awesome. Those are bright, they look great. Let me pop this off real quick so you can see what this one looks like. Um, if it's just gonna be straight LED. Oh, I'm sorry. Wow, that's freaking cool looking. Um, I'm going to talk about that in a second. Um, so you can kind of see the difference there. Uh, really nice, really bright. Um, I really like the look of these. And I'll say you did a great job. So we're going to go back to what you've just seen, which is a daylight running light. So they have multiple different ones. So you have this, you have a couple different colors, right? We can switch through these colors like this just by uh, tapping uh, the button here and it actually illuminates, and if you do this, it illuminates as well. Uh, long press, those shut off. We're gonna give you a night demonstration. These lights look awesome. They're gonna look fantastic at night, so just hang tight, and we're gonna check them out. All right, guys, so um, I ended up wiring it through one of the, through the firewall. Um, I really like these lights, and Novsite, you did it. You got me to switch from your original three inch, three inch pod lights to the halos. Um, I'm going to show you how I did it real quick. Kind of like my other one. Uh, you have to push it through um, the barrier there. And I'm going to show you a second what it looks like. Sorry, this looks like a mess. I swear it's not. I will clean it up. I have my existing wire still going to the box, which I'm going to actually remove those and I will replace them uh, with these. But down there is where I uh, brought it right there um, through the firewall and let me show you what I'm thinking about a mounting place uh, I'm going to continue to keep my uh, to keep my panel right here however um, I'm gonna run this wire up I think through here and I might just duck it under here but I was thinking um, this is the thing I'm thinking of just maybe it's very low profile, but if I kept everything, you know, pretty tight, I could do something like that. I, I would wire this, and I didn't think of it until now. Um, if I was going to keep it on that side, I should have pushed it through here first. I might be able to get this head through, but man i and i'm not gonna fight with that again <laughs> this was to help me get it through so i think that's the way um i'm gonna do it i'll show you guys what i end up doing at the end of the day um but these lights are sick can't wait to show you what they look like at night all right guys so i'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate uh how these are supposed to work so you should be able to hear me while I walk inside the truck. Or sit inside the truck. So I went ahead and I toggled this a little different. So I'm going to walk you through the main lights. So here, here they are. These are my daylight running lights. 
um, sorry, not the main lights, sorry, I had my switch upside down. Um, so as you can see, you can toggle through these. <clears throat> and I'm gonna show you something cool in a minute. Um, so you long press, shuts them off. Here are your <laughs> bright lights, they are really bright. Um, I'll show you more at night, so we're just getting there. I'm gonna pop these covers off and I wanna see, I think my LED running lights will match with the LED lights when I pop these amber covers off. So let's take a look. So I'm gonna fire on my LED running lights. So here are my, let me see if those even turned on. I forget if they do, they should. All right, so we got these on. I'm gonna pop these covers off real quick. And I just wanna see how cool it looks if, um, I'm thinking this should uh, illuminate um, LED or give it a, or give it that appearance. So here we go. <clears throat> Let's see. Does is that looking like I think it's looking? Okay. Let me step back to. <laughs> okay. So you got LED halos and you got LED running lights. I mean. Guys, that is <laughs> that's freaking sick, man. Look at that. Those are sick nasty. So hang on a second. Let me just uh let me go ahead and toggle through some colors here a second. Because we're gonna get a couple different colors um with these uh running lights. So we got we got there. I can't see I'm inside the truck, y'all, so two. So you should have a few there. Did that cycle back to the normal ones? Yeah, okay. Um, so that's pretty awesome. And then of course you have your super bright LEDs, but I mean that is really cool. Oh yeah, and then you have the choice um, for ambers, which I mean, heck, even that looks freaking badass. Running ambers, LEDs, and then and then ambers. I mean, that looks that looks freaking awesome. So we're gonna go ahead and wait for a a night shot. We're gonna show you some more, but these things are awesome. All right, guys. So it is dark. These look nice. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of set this up so you guys can see. I'm going to turn. I'm going to turn the my LEDs off a second, but I wanted to show you kind of like what those halos look like with this. And we're going to go through the we're going to go we're going to go through them a second. So with that completely off, right? You got this. Completely off. We'll turn those off. We got them that are really, really bright. All right. Now we're gonna we're gonna take a. So you can see that without the LEDs on. Now I want to show you what it's gonna look like with these covers off. So we pop these covers off. And you got a whole new look. So that is a whole new look there. And it looks really good. Uh, those halos are really nice and bright. You know, that you can see there. Now I'm going to turn back on my, my LED markers. Because I think they look pretty cool. Um, that these match so now you have matching <laughs> that is pretty sick so that's sick looking when you uh, when you look at it so all right so now you guys got an idea of how these halos look they're awesome let's check out um, what it looks like when we go ahead and turn them full on So super bright. You can see that these uh, three inch pod lights are super bright. So again, let's go ahead and put our 
Amber's back on so I can show you the difference. I'm popping the Amber's back on right now. You're not going to notice a difference yet. I'm going to go ahead and turn these on now. So turning them on now. There's our Amber's. Those are pretty bright. So you can see when I walk, <laughs> it's very bright, right? Super bright. Want you to see. Really nice. Those are nice looking. I'm gonna go ahead and throw uh, just the halos back on again so you can see that. I'm gonna turn the main lights off. Now those halos are just on and super nice looking. So you can see when the halos are not in their uh, LED status. These are the amber halos. Right, those are the amber halos that you you see. You'll see a slight color variation when I switch it to LED a second. You can see that it becomes a little lighter. You see, you notice how it just became a little lighter, a little bit different colors, and that's because this light now, instead of being amber, it is now like an LED, the LED white versus here. Either way, um, these are awesome. So Knobsite, y'all did a great job. I mean, these lights are, are brilliant. I like them so much, I switched them out. Uh, these are going to be my new, um, my new running lights here. I'm going to keep these on. I think they're a great design, a great build quality, and the functionality of them is just awesome. They look good going down the road. I like the idea of having a halo marker light uh, or a daylight running light per se, and I can turn it on. I did not wire it into my switch panel yet. I'm going to probably do that and I'll figure it out uh, once I, I get that, once I get there. But I did temporarily wire my switch in there and I still gotta figure out how I wanna put it, but Knobsite, another great product. Awesome lights, they look great. They're built awesome and at a good price. You just can't beat it. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, check the description and I'll put in our discount code and everything in there and go out and grab a pair of these. These things are awesome, guys. You're really going to like it.